welcome to Stephanie Uncensored and the book I'll be reviewing is The Neighborhood by Stilo Phantom. So this is the second book in the Twin Estates uh, series and I was provided this book for an honest and voluntary as an arc as an honest uh, and voluntary review. So let's get to this review because it's very, very interesting. The first book left us off with a lots and lots of angst. Um, it's called The Neighbor or The Neighbors and it has three main characters, Katya, Liam and Wolfick. And these three characters go through this journey of, you know, sort of knowing each other, but living near each other and how they mix and mingle together. There's lots of drama that goes along with it. Um, so this is a continuation of that book. And in the neighborhood, you start off about two weeks after the ending of Neighbors and you find that Katya is trying to find herself still and is still on the edge of not knowing who she wants to be with, what she wants to do with her life. Um, she's on a sabbatical from bakery um, where she works and designs cakes and everything like that. So she is really like seriously trying to find herself and it's kind of frustrating um, because the things that Liam and Wolfick did to her is like, why don't you just cut your losses and, you know, just continue on with your life other ways. And then we're introduced to a whole slew of new characters. Um, it's just, it's just crazy. It's absolutely crazy. I gave this book four stars um, because I did enjoy it and um, I appreciated where Stilo was trying to go with it. But at the same time, it really, really frustrated me um, because it just seemed like they were making the same mistakes over and over and over again. Um, yeah, I mean, just a slew of characters. She's a sly, uh, Katya is a sly, the shy girl that finds her, finds her sexy side, finds her, you know, I am woman, hear me roar side. Wolfick is this like billionaire that used to live next to her back when she was in her hometown. And she had always sort of lusted after him I guess you could say and had a crush on him and you know watched him he's a swimmer he's this real estate mogul and he just he's really swoony I mean I loved him as a character but then you have Liam who is this sex club manager owner and he's also swoony and you know carefree and fun sort of guy. So if we could mix the two of them together, I would say that would be like the perfect guy um, for Katya because that would give her her adventure side, but also give her that emotional connection that she has always longed for and that she has lusted after since living at home with her parents. So they go through a lot of drama and then you have a whole bunch of slew of other characters. You have Wolfwick sisters that are introduced. You have another neighbor that's introduced. You have Liam's brother that's introduced. And Oh, you have Katya's um, roommate that was introduced um, in the first book, but also she plays a big part in this book as well. So it's like, there's so many characters. I really hope that the series continues on after this book. Um, I do believe that Stilo has a uh, sort of spinoff or maybe a companion book that's going to come out about Liam and his life. So, you know, I'm kind of looking forward to that. and Maybe we'll get some more insight into the neighborhood. But um, as I said, I gave it four stars. I really did like it, even though it was filled with drama and twists and turns and angst and frustration and um, things like that. So check that out. It's called The Neighborhood by Stilo Phantom. And thanks for watching and we'll see you guys later. Bye.